Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. In this video, I would like to give another example on interpolation. See the statement of the given problem. Apply suitable interpolation formula to estimate the value of tan of 0.12. It means that we have to find out the value of tan theta at the point theta is equal to 0.12. Clearly, we are observing that this point theta is equal to 0.12 is at the first interval of the given data. This is the given data. Clearly, data lies in the first interval, which is starting of the given data. That's why Newton's forward interpolation formula is the suitable interpolation formula. Okay. Here, data is given from 0.10 to 0.30 with the equal difference h is equal to 0.05. Given data has equal parts. And also data lies in the starting of the data. That's why Newton's forward interpolation formula is suitable. Okay. So first of all, we should consider the forward difference table. Take side heading. Forward difference table. Okay. In the first column, we should write the x values from the given data. For our convenience, I will take data values as x values and uh, tan theta values are respect to functioning values y. Here directly function is given as tan theta. Okay. In some problems, function may not given. Okay. So, x is equal to theta is the first column and uh, y is equal to tan theta is the second column. Now, third column onwards, we have to start the forward differences. First order forward difference which is represented by delta y. Next one is delta square y. Next one is delta cube y. Once count the number of given data points from the data. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 5 values are given for x and y. That's why you should get up to fourth order forward difference in the difference table which is delta power 4 y. Now write the data values. 0 0.10 0 0.15 0 0.20 0 0.25 and finally 0 0.30 Write the respective y values which are 0 0.1003, 0 0.1511, 0 0.2027, 0 0.2553 and finally 0 0.3093 which is the value of y at theta is equal to 0 0.30. Okay. Now we have to fill the gaps. How can we find the differences lower value minus upper value and write their difference in between them 0 0.1511 minus 0 0.1003 so which is 0 0.0508 next 0 0.20 27 minus 0 0.1511 which is 0 0.0516 next 0 0.2553 minus 0 0.2027 which is 0 0.0526 next finally lower value minus upper value write their difference in between them 0 0.30393 minus 0 0.2553 sorry 0 0.3093 minus 0 0.2553 which is 0 0.054 I will write fourth decimal place as 0 see 0 0.0516 minus 0 0.0508 which is 0 0.0008 it should be fourth decimal place because it has 8 into 10 to the power of minus 4 next 0 0.0526 minus 0 0.0516 
which is 0 0.001. One should be third decimal place. You should write fourth decimal place as 0. Next, 0 0.0540 minus 0 0.0526. Which is 0 0.0014. One should be third decimal place. Now, what is 0 0.0010 minus 0 0.000002 and 0 0.0014 minus 0 0.0010 is 0 0.0004. Finally, it is 0 0.0002. Okay, in this way we should construct the forward difference table. Okay, constructing of the forward difference table is very very important. Okay, now we should write what is our aim in this problem. We have to find out. We have to find tan of zero point one two. That is, we have to find. We have to find y at x at x is equal to 0 0.12 okay for our convenience here I will take the data as x which is at the starting of the data okay hence Newton's forward interpolation formula is applicable. Formula is suitable or applicable as you wish. That is, you should write this data, this in Newton's forward interpolation formula for given data only. Y of x is equal to y naught plus p into delta y naught plus p into p minus 1 by 2 factorial into delta square y naught plus p into p minus 1 into p minus 2 by 3 factorial into delta cube y naught plus p into p minus 1 into p minus 2 into p minus 3 by 4 factorial into delta power 4 y naught. Take the equation about 1. Okay, clearly we are observing that this is x0 value and this is xn value and this is y0 value and this is yn value. y0 is nothing but 0 0.1003. Whenever we are going to apply Newton's forward interpolation formula, please round up the first corner values in the difference table. So, because we are using, we are going to using these values in this formula. So, this is delta y0. Since y0 is the first value, first value in the delta column is delta y0. First value in the delta square column is delta square y naught. This is delta q y naught. And uh, this is delta power 4 y naught. Okay. See. Now I will find P here. Now P is equal to. In Newton's forward interpolation formula. P is nothing but. X minus X naught by H. So what is X value? 0 0.12. Okay, so 0 0.12 minus what is x0 value, first value in the given data, 0 0.10 by 0 0.05. Already I told you here, difference between the x values is 0 0.05. See, 0 0.12 minus 0 0.10 by 0 0.05. Which is 0 0.4 okay so now I will replace this difference table values uh, and p value in this formula you will get from one implies you will get y of 0 0.12 is equal to what is y naught 0 0.1003 plus what is p value we got 0 0.4 okay into what is delta y naught 0 0.4 0508 this one plus p into p minus 1 
जीरो पॉइंट फोर इंटू जीरो पॉइंट फोर माइनस वन इज नथिंग बट जीरो पॉइंट सिक्स बाय टू फैक्टोरियल इंटू डेल्टा स्क्वायर वाई नॉट वॉट इज डेल्टा स्क्वायर वाई नॉट दिस वन जीरो पॉइंट ट्रिपल जीरो एट प्लस पी इंटू पी माइनस वन विच इज नेगेटिव जीरो पॉइंट सिक्स पी माइनस टू ओके इट वुड बी माइनस वन पॉइंट सिक्स पॉइंट फोर माइनस टू इज नथिंग बट माइनस वन पॉइंट सिक्स बाय थ्री फैक्टर यू कैन आंसर राइट डायरेक्टली सिक्स एंड डेल्टा क्यूब वॉट इज डेल्टा क्यूब जीरो पॉइंट ट्रिपल जीरो टू दिस वन प्लस एंड फाइनल टर्म इज पी इंटू पी माइनस वन जीरो पॉइंट फोर इंटू माइनस जीरो पॉइंट सिक्स इंटू माइनस वन पॉइंट सिक्स इंटू पॉइंट फोर माइनस थ्री विच इज माइनस टू पॉइंट सिक्स बाय फोर फैक्टर इज नथिंग बट ट्वेंटी फोर इंटू लास्ट डिफरेंस टेबल वैल्यू सो जीरो पॉइंट ट्रिपल जीरो Okay, now we have to find out. We have to simplify this entire calculation scientific calculator. But here I will give you a wonderful technique to you. Already given function is tan theta. So directly by using scientific calculator, you can easily get the value of tan of zero point one two. Okay, see. So tan of zero point one two. So which is zero point One two zero five. Directly, you can copy this value from your scientific calculator. You can also simplify this one in our scientific calculator. Surely, you will get the similar value. No doubt at all. You can check it. Okay, this is the one of the application of the Newton's forward interpolation formula. Thank you very much. In the next video, I will give some more problems. Bye.